Hey guys, Sly here, and welcome back to a brand new video. Uh, today, we're going to be playing some Walking Dead Saints and Sinners. Casey, you there? Casey, you there? Oh, he's gone. Uh, well... We're going to go on another, um... Survivor hunt. We're going to hunt down another cache. So let's do that, shall we? Uh... Going to the shallows. Alright, so we are in the shallows again. Use the drawing to find the tower cache and retrieve the intel. So, drawings. I have to really pump it now. Don't step the body with the screwdriver. <laughs> Death so much shotgun ammo, it's not even funny. Unfortunately. Freeze.
Oh yeah, I forgot it. Now I don't have to unlock it anymore. This makes it so Walker much in Finish it. I like this gun. It makes it so much easier to kill survivors. I got a shotgun too, Missy. Oh, <laughs> gotta throw that far away, that's great. Yeah, now I have to jump down there. I could really die if I do that. Mama's sick. <laughs> Let's grab the ass trays. Oh, I'm full. Yeah. 
Grimes. Rick Grimes. Nah, Rick Grimes. No, 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 it's not sideways, it's like this. I forgot. Resting place. <laughs> All right, and I have returned, and I am hurting pretty badly, so I'm gonna bandage myself up. <sighs> But max this out, looks like. Fourth and pain. The X Man loved Jazz Mafioso bastard and his gaudy. The shipping business in the ward. Let's go on there. All 
right. So we're gonna go to the coffin. And uh, we're gonna do this. I guess we could pet and we could move on to the next night or next day or whatever. Alright, available supplies have dwindled. The dead have grown in number. Alright. Tomb in the tower. Yep, it's lit up. you've been gathering for me has been enlightening to say the least. Georgia is planning on a mass exile in the very near future. Oh. Many lives are going to be at risk. I have a few things to discuss with you. I know we were going to try to avoid the face-to-face, -face, but the plan I'm formulating warrants it. I'd appreciate your ear. Meet me in the same spot as the first time. Churchyard. Thanks for all you're doing. May. Hmm. So I have to go through that place again. Underneath the whatchamacallit. I'm gonna try the fourth in pain. A weapon. This might actually be a pretty decent weapon. How's it going, May? Of course. I'll get right to the point. After looking over the intel you brought me, mm -hmm. it seems like Georgia is planning to toss out a large number of people real soon. A lot of lives are going to be in jeopardy. Good news is we have some hope. The map you scored shows a safe way out of Nola. Just need to buy some time and some space to organize exiles on a large scale. Get them ready to move. I think the reserve is going to provide the opening I need. Georgia and the tower are so obsessed with it, don't think they'll be concerned with what I'm doing for a short while. And with the Reclaim salivating over it too, once the reserve is unlocked and revealed to the world, courtesy of you, there's gonna be a bloodbath. You can count on that. All right. And that's when I make my move. Window won't be open long though. It'll be tight, but I gotta take the chance. I don't know, May. Sounds risky. Yeah. Trying to get that many people out at once without Georgia noticing? You've seen the posters everywhere. She's trying to turn the whole city against you. Maybe you should just get out with Ombra while you have the chance. You can't be serious. After all the work my daughter and I have put in to make this dream a reality, 
You think I should turn my back on the people I've been working so hard to help? No. I'm all in, tourist. I appreciate your concern. We are going to uphold our promise to these people. Do or die. I will leave the key to the reserve in the drop spot for you. Lantern will be on when it's there. When the shit goes down for the reserve, if you're thinking it's all too much and you want out, come find us. The Exodus could use someone with your particular set of talents. My hope is you won't be a fool, but my mind suspects you'll be too hooked on that damn reserve pipe dream just like everybody else. All I can do is wish you good luck and good judgment, tourist. Take care of yourself. All right. So we're gonna run to Casey and tell him about the key. Casey, good news. May said she would give me the key we need. Good news? Help, tourist. I would classify that as fucking outstanding news. No, look, I, I don't want to jinx it, but... No, uh... You know what? I'm gonna keep my mouth shut. Best not to risk the jinx. Let let's just forge ahead. One step at a time. All okay, right. so, um... The part to repair the final pump. Gosh, I... I, I don't have much to go on. It's weird. There's been really faint chatter about it on a few channels. There's been nothing but static for months. Uh, th there's an outpost called Bastion, set up in a heavily defended duplex home. Uh, barricades and optimal sight lines. The reclaimed currently control it. Now, the place has been a hotbed of conflict between Tower and Reclaimed for a while. From what I'm hearing, that's where it is, so be ready for a shitstorm. Good luck, and hey, Keep your head on a swivel. Hey, Casey. How's it going? Oh, hey, tourist. Honestly, I'm a little freaked out. All right. Hey, Casey. How's it going? Oh, hey, tourist. Enough already. I get it. Other stuff on your mind. Okay, back to it. Where were we? I have to step away for a minute. I get it. Other stuff on your mind. Okay, let's see. Travel to Bastion, find the regulation dial. How's it doing? Ooh. I might build another one, actually. Yeah, I'm building one, actually. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Okay, back to I'm out. Okay, I'll be here. Oh, not my statue. Continue. Enough already. I get it. Other stuff on your mind. <sighs> Fourth in pain. We're 
gonna head over to Bastion. Bastion, Bastion, okay. Yep, travel to Bastion. Alright, so... We are here at Bastion. Let's get this real quick. Mm. Equip forth in pain. And we're gonna collect as much as we can. That's not it. Guess I'll just wander around till there's survivors. I see. Oh, there it is. Lights all over. Is it? I don't know. This looks like it. Wait a minute, are they at the top floor? That could be it. You made it. You made it. I didn't doubt that you would, of course, but my patience was beginning to be tested. <laughs> Let's start with a formal introduction. Okay. You are the tourist, and I am Jean-Baptiste. JB for short. There now, we can proceed to matters of more profound consequence. It is my understanding that this gizmo here would be of use to you. It's all yours. Consider it a gift. And when we are finished with our conversation, I will provide you with the missing dial that you'll need to operate it. Sound fair? Uh, sure. Sounds fair. Terrific. Now, I prefer to play it straight. Once I received word that you were collecting these devices, and to what purpose, I saw an opportunity to connect with the city's most illustrious survivor and have a chat about the reserve. So I made it a priority to acquire one through various means I will not divulge. 
And now here you are. It is my hope when I am through, you will see the reserve for what it is. Nothing more than a crutch, holding back the people of this fine city from regaining themselves. You've piqued my interest. Go on. What? I am a firm believer in the greatness of humankind. Our ingenuity, our art, our towering scientific achievements. This reserve nonsense, even if the rumors about what may be inside it exceed our wildest dreams, the bounty will only prolong our addiction to survivalism as the only path in life. It will stifle our creativity. It will eventually lead to our withering doom. Now, this is the proposal that I have for you. Continue your search for the reserve. And when you unearth it, which I have the utmost confidence you will, Destroy it. These four numbers will disable the entire flood contingency system. Mother Nature will rage through the reserve and take care of the rest. One, zero, zero, six. Flood the reserve and set us all free. Give this still glorious city the jump start it needs to refocus on something much grander than mere survival. Grant us hope tourist and thank you most sincerely for hearing me out and let's keep this chat between us if that's all right i'm not sure my comrades would see the big picture benefits of removing the reserve from the equation the floor is now yours my friend anything on your mind that requires clarity i'm curious about the reclaimed yes well I've heard snippets about the reclaimed philosophy, but it would be enlightening to hear it from you. It's simple, really. We want to live purposeful lives, reclaim the world and our humanity along with it. Mere survival is so petty. It's beneath us, forcing people to focus solely on survival. It's cruel, really. I believe we must invest in a future of our own design. Life is not worth living otherwise. What's with the gory rituals? First one was a man I knew well in my brief tenure as a tower grunt. I'd even called him a friend. Trip was his name. Snuck up on me in the middle of sleep. Tried to slit my throat. Still carry the scar. Well, long story short, Trip was no match for me. I maimed him. Something awful, really. And I dragged his body about a mile all the way to the southern bump which at the time was the most highly trafficked exit from the tower. I found an old oak, hung him upside down from it so his lifeblood would spill rapidly into the soil, and upon his chest I pinned a note that read, Keep him coming. And just like that, I became the most feared boogeyman Nola has seen since the Axe Man. Once I had fear on my side, the rest just blossomed naturally. Those with nowhere okay. else to go wanted what I had, so they listened. And they learned. I empowered them. That's all people want. A sense that their lives still have some meaning. The reclaimed have made quite a mark on the city. How did the movement get started? After my exile from the tower for insubordination, I took to raiding their supply lines. Rather efficiently, I might add. No one ever got okay. hurt, and other exiles clamored to join my operations. Needless to say, Mama and her cohorts were not pleased with my exploits, and they sent several communications asking me to cease my pillaging or there'd be consequences. <laughs> of course, I refused, politely. No one was going to dictate the terms of my existence anymore. But it wasn't until the tower started sending thugs out to track me down and in me that I decided it was time to send a message of my own. I have some other questions for you, JB. I want your perspective on the reserve. Uh-huh. If the rumors about what's inside the reserve are true, wouldn't it benefit the reclaimed to get your hands on it? You are absolutely correct. 
But once those supplies are gone, then what? The same old fruitless pursuits. And there is the very distinct possibility that the tower gets to it before we do. The only way to guarantee this city will move forward in the proper direction is to remove the reserve from the equation entirely. Why choose me to destroy the reserve? Because you're the one best equipped to find the accursed place, and I trust you will do the right thing when you do. Call it a hunch. How did you find this code to flood the reserve? One of my scouts came across the corpse of a National Guardsman in Rampart High School. The body had mm -hmm. a manual for a bunker's flood defense system. I put two and two together. I have some other questions for you, JB. I've heard enough. Fair enough. Then we are finished here. The Dow, as promised. Godspeed, tourist. here then. I thought it was going to be a big fight. Huh. Well, thanks, JB. Finally meet, tourist. After all the hype, you're not exactly what I expected. Thought you'd be more put together, a bit more danger to your presence. You know who I am, but I'm not sure I know who you are. I have a guess, but... I'm Georgia. Maybe you heard of me, maybe not. I could give two shits. What does concern me is the man inside the building you just stepped out of. The time has come to silence him once and for all. Cut off the head that won't shut up. Rest of the reclaimed fools will fall back in line. Then us tower folk can get back to doing what's right. Without all the noise. From what I know about JB, it may take more than you and a couple of goons to take him down. You a real smart ass tourist. I fucking love smart asses. Oh, thank Especially you. Especially when I've snipped the tongues out of their smart ass mouths. But I'm willing to give you a pass on your smart ass ways. Just this once. I'm gonna offer you an opportunity to be a hero. You game? That depends. What the fuck do you want me to do? Quit fucking with me, fool. You know what I want. March back up into that house and kill JB. Prove you are worth more to the tower than the cockroach you've been so far. And in return, all your fucked up transgressions will be forgiven. If you happen to find yourself in the midst of our onslaught on the reserve, tower troops will have your back. You have my word. This is your conflict, not mine. I'm not a hired gun for the tower. That's a goddamn shame, tourist. JB is not walking out of that place alive whether you get involved or not. What you don't seem to realize, however, is your fate if you defy me. Let me clarify. Do as you are told, or you are dead. Mm. Just another lost soul. Oh yeah, I'm warning JB. I don't think he deserves to die. You've returned. To what do I owe the pleasure, tourist? The tower troops are outside. They want you dead. I suggest you get out of here. Well, look at you, tourist. Choosing sides. I suppose that's a good sign regarding our previous conversation. For a rogue spirit, you certainly have proven pivotal in the fight for the soul of this godforsaken and still glorious city. I have no designs on escape. I plan to march right out of this house, gun drawn, and send a message. If you feel like joining me, I suggest you keep up. When it comes to violence, I am decisive and swift.
Together we might have been able to handle twice as many tower goons. I had forgotten how much I enjoyed the thrill of a brawl. Been a while. Thanks for reminding me. And now I must bid you farewell. All right, we're gonna head right back out. a very interesting way that went down. But yeah, I really wanted to take down Mama, cause, or Georgia, because she really seemed like a very terrible person. Alright, so we have returned. Which means we are going to head back to the bus. I don't think I really grabbed much, but... Let's, uh, recycle I'm back, Casey. Ready to repair the pump. You still alive? Yeah. Alive, but almost swimming. No turning back after this, tourist. We have to get after it. I'm running out of time. You prepared? You know what? Let's do it. I'm ready. Okay. Serial number first. 749-0003-13. All right. Um, set valve A to 38. 38. Valve A, 38. Green. Valve B needs to be set at 44. Valve B, 44, A, B, double green. You're a machine, tourist. Okay, valve C, set it to 60. Valve C to 60, green all around. Button press and we are calibrated. Excellent, okay. The last pump is not far from the cemetery. It's in a concrete industrial shed in the old jazz park, near the statue of the musicians. Should be easy to... Stepping away for a bit. I get it. Oh, no, no, no. Other stuff on your mind. Continue. Welcome back. Excellent. Okay. The light it's in a concrete and should be easy to find. The key you got from May unlocks the door to the shed. Now once the part is installed to me and I'll get the pump system started. We are access to the reserve for you. Get the fuck out of the reserve for me. Alright, let's go. And the next part will be the last part. Uh this is Sly McFly and I'm out.